Hey friends, it's Haley, and welcome to my first ever video for BookTube. My introduction to this channel, Reads with Haley. I'm so excited to be here and to get to talk to you guys about some really great reads. I debated a little bit about where to start off with this video, um, whether I should start with a book tag or um, maybe a TBR or something. And then I found the newbie booktube tag, and I figured that that was the perfect introduction, so I decided I might as well start with that. Um, so, a few things to know about me before we get started. My name is Haley, obviously. I'm a rising junior in college, studying political science at university. I also am a big theater nerd. Uh, I was a theater major until I dropped that to a minor. Um, and I absolutely love, love, love to read Have ever since I was... I can't even remember. Um, I'm such a big reader, such a big book nerd, and I'm super excited to get to know some of you guys on this channel and just talk about books and have a good time, you know, gushing over our favorite read. So without further ado, um, we're gonna get started with the newbie book tag, which I'm super excited about. It's perfect introduction, I think, to booktube, and um, I can't wait to answer some of these questions. So let's get started. Okay. Question number one, why did you start this channel? Well, okay, I've been wanting to start book a booktube channel for a long time, and uh, with everything that's going on with coronavirus and quarantine, this seemed like the perfect time to start. Um, I've been reading a lot more lately, I've been in a better mood, um, and so I, I f felt that it was um, a good time to start. I love talking about books, and uh, not a lot of my friends in real life read um, all that much or read the books that I read, so I figured that this would be a great way to really get started um, talking to some other people, making connections, and uh, really getting to um, express that enthusiasm about reading that we all have. So, um, yeah, that's why I started it now, I guess. Um, two, what are some fun and unique things you can bring to YouTube? Well, I am a very enthusiastic reader and a very positive reader. I tend to like most of the books I read, even if they aren't the best written or they aren't necessarily um, the best quality literature. If you can get me to care about the characters and getting me to care about characters is very easy, I will be 110% invested in them and their story and what happens to them. So a lot of my books talks and book reviews are going to be more book gushes because I tend to gush about my favorite books and, and, and just talk about the things that I loved and the things that I um, that stood out to me, the characters that I loved, the dynamics, the relationships, things like that. So I'm a very, so if you're the type of person who likes to gush about books, um, and if you're the type of person who's a, not necessarily a very picky reader but just likes to discuss them, um, a fangirl over them, if you will, then this is the channel for you. Question number three, what are you most excited for about this new channel? I'm so excited to meet some more of you guys, to get to know some of you, the viewers, if I have viewers, hopefully. Um, get to really um, meet new people who really are inv as invested in reading as I am, who love stories and love characters and, and, and just entering different worlds and being absorbed in them, I, I, I would, I love that, and I would love to, um, I love to make new friends, and, and I definitely, um, see this as a gateway to do that, to meet, to meet you guys, to talk to you guys, um, and just to have fun with you, and that's what I'm really looking forward to the most for. Why do you love reading? Well, this is a really, a difficult question. I think it can be summed up by my favorite quote from To Kill a Mockingbird, um, which, in which Scout says, uh, um, until I feared I would lose it, I did not love to read. One does not love breathing. Um, I've always been a reader. It's always been my escape. I had, um, you know, a rough time in school growing up, and, and getting to, uh, read was really, my escape. It was my um, way of, of coping with the world and dealing with the world and, and enjoying myself, you know? Um, I, I, I made friends in books where I, I couldn't really make friends in real life, and uh, that was sort of the starting point for me um, in reading, was, was being young and not quite fitting in and, and escaping into books to, to, to find my people so to speak. Um, so yeah, that's, um, 
why I love reading is because I, I can't remember not loving it. I always have. I don't, I've always needed it. And, um, it, it's, it's so much a part of me that I don't know who I'd be without it. I don't know what I am if I'm not a reader. What book or series got you into reading? Well, okay, so I first remember being really into Green Eggs and Ham when I first started reading, like when I first learned how to read. I remember Dr. Seuss's Green Eggs and Ham was my favorite. I read it over and over again. I had it memorized. The first series that I really remember getting me to be a hardcore reader was um, the Magic Tree House series by Mary Pope Osborne. I don't know if any of you ever read those, but it was about a magical tree house that um, had piles and piles of books in it and these two kids Jack and Annie uh, they could be transported into any of the places in the books they were reading and I just found that so fascinating I read every single one of them I devoured them in that library do you remember when we had library as kids and um I, I just I couldn't stop and I remember I, I was in kindergarten when I started reading them and then I by the time we got I got to first grade um our teacher would read them aloud to us and I had already read them all because I was so obsessed with that series and um that really started my love of books about books and I really do love um books that have to do with reading and the love of reading and um the love of stories uh so yeah that that definitely made a huge impact on me as a kid what questions would you ask your favorite booktubers? I would probably ask, what is your editing process like? And how do you rehearse what you're going to say beforehand? Because I am telling you, I'm having trouble with this one, guys. There's a lot of stopping and starting. Hopefully, I'll be able to edit this well enough in Windows Movie Maker that it will be um, somewhat coherent. But if not, what you're getting is going to be pretty all over the place. So I apologize in advance for that. But... Um, question number seven is, what challenges do you think starting a booktube channel will be the hardest to overcome? I think, um, the rehearsing process, like, um, getting to know what I'm going to say before I say it, and, um, making sure that I, uh, do rehearse that, because I tend to kind of wing it, um, in certain ways, and, uh, I'm going to have to really buckle down and, like, start thinking about what I want to say before I say it. Um, I also think that just getting... Uh, okay with constructive criticism, because I tend to be pretty sensitive, um, uh, but being okay with constructive criticism and ignoring any, like, hate that comes, hopefully there won't be any, but you know, it's YouTube, hate comes, um, and, and just, um, having faith in myself, having faith in myself that, um, I have something to say and that it's worth listening to, to some people at least, and, uh, hopefully that that'll be enough. When did you start reading? So I started reading... Again, in preschool, I had um, Dr. Seuss books that I remember loving, but um, I started reading chapter books in kindergarten, and um, I, that was what really got me hooked on reading, and I've been reading consistently ever since. I used to get in trouble in school for reading books underneath my desk, um, and I used to get them taken away because I um, would be so absorbed in what I was reading that I wouldn't want to stop. You know, I've been reading pretty much my entire life, basically, since I could read, I've been reading and never stopped. Nine, where do you read? I read everywhere and anywhere. I read when I'm at school. I read in my room probably most of the time. I read when I'm in class and there's a lull in the com in the what you know we're discussing. I read in the car. I read on planes. I read. Um, when I'm waiting for a friend to pick me up, I wait, for, I read, um, at restaurants sometimes when I'm with my family, which is not good, you should not do, it's rude, but I do, um, I read everywhere, basically, I, um, I read on my phone a lot, because I get a lot of Kindle books, because I am a poor college student, and, um, hardcover books are expensive, um, so I, uh, tend to read, um, a lot on my phone, and since my phone is with me everywhere, I tend to read everywhere. 10. What kind of books do you like to read? I like to read any and all kinds of books. Um, YA is pretty much my favorite genre. I really like reading about young people and them taking on the challenges, whether it be a contemporary, taking on the challenges of life, of, you know, being a teenager, being a young adult, or, you know, you got your, um, 
Hunger Games Rebellion taking on an oppressive government, which is one of my favorite sort of tropes in YA literature. I just really like reading about young people and them overcoming difficulties and, and people underestimating them and, and just being badass, basically. Okay, that is it. That is the end of the booktube newbie tag. And that was so much fun. Um, I really enjoyed answering these questions. I hope that you guys enjoyed listening to me answer these questions. Um, please leave feedback down below. It really means a lot. And um, uh, let me know of anything. I'm super receptive to what you guys want to see. So if you, I'm going to do a birthday book haul because it was just my birthday. Um, but if you guys want to see specific book talks or book reviews from certain books I'm definitely receptive to what you guys want to see um let me know and I will bump things up on my TBR as it comes um as the feedback comes in and uh yeah um it was so nice to get to talk to you guys I'm really excited for this journey I hope that you stick around um thank you so much for watching uh like comment subscribe it really does help me out and um i'll see you on the next video bye guys